<laughs> I just wanted to add something. I don't know. I hear you. Or a hot dog on a stick. Oh. Yeah. Well, now, before yeah. it was like a hot dog on like a okay. actual stick that I, you'd like pick up off the ground. That's true. Oh no! Oh, Stupid that's clams. Scary. Don't ever say that to a woman. God fucking stupid clam! Easy. Her name is Jennifer! I hate clams. You do not. It's a fucking asshole! Fuck off, you fucking clam! Why won't it fucking God? It's so bullshit! I think. Just fuck. Ah! <laughs> I hate it! Oh my god, now I'm dead! Because of this stupid fucking clam! I was shooting it the whole time! I think this is a good time to end this episode, I think, maybe. Oh my fucking god. Okay, so as I mentioned before, a lot of the charm from the original Zelda was how ruthless the game was, and a complex fighting system would be perfect place to implement that. But, the source of a lot of Ocarina's problems is that the game's idea of difficulty is waiting. There is so much goddamn waiting in Ocarina. Every enemy has a period where they just stand around and do fucking nothing, and attacking them during this time is useless. Deku Scrubs, Stalfos, Lizard Men, Skulltolas, Wolf Dudes, Gerudos, Clams? Waiting is not a difficult thing to do, but it creates the illusion of difficulty because it takes up your time. And that's all it does. Just fuck. Ah! <laughs> I hate it! Oh my god, now I'm dead! Because of this stupid fucking clam! But it creates the illusion of difficulty. I think watching you get fucked up by a, a clam. For 45 seconds, probably. We're not- we're- there's nowhere to go but down from there.